MyFoamFitness.com and today we are talking about the foam roller and why you should be using it. I wrote a great article so I'm going to put the link below so you can get all the detailed information. But what I want you to know is yes, you should be foam rolling. It's going to take the tension out of your muscles. It's going to break down the lactic acid so your body can detox. It's going to bring more oxygen to your cells, to your muscles. It is just a great overall tool for your fitness and weight loss toolbox. So today I just want to show you how to use the foam roller. You've probably seen people using it at the gym. So one of the first places we can use it and where we hold a lot of tension is our booty otherwise known as the glutes. And all you need to do is roll back and forth on it nice and gently. You can go 20 to 30 seconds, up to a minute, whatever you need for your body. So that's the booty. We're gonna move it down here. We're gonna work on our hamstrings. And we just roll back and forth, and back and forth. It's breaking down that any muscle tissue that might be tight. You know how you get those knots in your body? This is great for taking those knots out. Now we can move down to our ankles and our calves, and you can just lift yourself up a little bit and roll back and forth. Get a good ab workout too when you do this. And if you want, you can cross your leg over and put a little bit more, it puts a little more pressure. Now I'm really feeling it. Ooh, I got some tight calves there. All right, switch it over. We can go to the other side. So that's what I call the back of the house. Now here, a lot of times we're very tight in our hip area. So this is a great one for the outer thigh because you know we do a lot of thigh work. Have you seen my thin thigh video series? Okay, roll it back and forth here. Man, oh man. You know what? It shouldn't hurt, like put you through the roof, but it may be a little bit uncomfortable when you first start foam rolling, and that's okay because you might have a lot of tension held in those muscles. So just go slow and be gentle with your body. You are gonna love foam rolling. Okay. So now we're gonna take it to the quads. And I like to um, roll my quads before my workout. It kind of just takes all that tension out. It lets my glutes work better. So here, we're gonna roll forward right there. Oh yeah, on the quads. Really, really great. We're even getting a little upper body workout now rolling back and forth. I almost forgot to show you how you can foam roll on your back. Just lie down and roll back and forth. It feels amazing. So you can do this, so you, can do this. you know, after your workouts, I always like you to stretch. Flexibility is so important. I also have a great uh, stretching video for you guys. I'll put the link down here, but just Practice with your foam roller. Start once a week. See and feel how your body responds and what you need. There's no right or wrong. Just doing. So go get yourself a foam ro roller, blah, blah, blah. You're going to love it. Okay. See you guys later. Bye-bye.